We will begin News 3 at 5 with our continuing coverage of breaking news from downtown Savannah. News 3 has confirmed that there are several injuries after a portion of the third floor collapsed at the federal courthouse. We're told Chatham EMS received a call around 345 this afternoon from that location, 125 Bull Street. And right now, WSAV News 3's Kyra Jones is on the scene there. Kyra, what have you learned about this building collapse? Yeah, it's definitely been a pretty active scene at the moment. We do know three people are injured at this time. This happened right at the federal courthouse. We know that a third floor collapsed going into the second floor. We've talked to fire EMS and we have talked to Mayor Johnson right now. Mayor Johnson is telling me that they have sent crews home, but if you're taking a live look at video now, there have been emergency crews taking people out of the out of the building and putting them into the emergency vehicles and transporting them to the hospital. Mayor Johnson has just told me that workers are done for the day. They do not know when workers will be returned back to work. We do know at this time that three people are confirmed injured and we don't know the updates on their injuries at this time. We will continue to bring you the latest information throughout the rest of the evening and into WSAV News 10 and 11. Right now reporting live in Savannah, Kyra Jones, WSAV News 3 on your side. All right, Kyra, thank you. I do want to uh, give you a bit more information on what we have learned here at WSAV as we continue to gather information coming in. Savannah Fire telling us to make sure that we urge you, if you are heading into the downtown area or if you're trying to leave, make sure that you avoid Wright Square. And that is the area between Whitaker, Broughton, Drayton and Liberty Streets. Of course, we will continue to bring you updates on air and online at WSAV com as we learn additional information about that floor collapse at the federal courthouse in downtown Savannah.